So Stalin gave an order to take as a punishment 5,000 prisoners of war only from Budapest. They gave us a train, a cattle train, 60 or 70 people in it, toilet and a pot to eat. It was winter, no heat, no clothes at all, and very little food. So there were a train which took us to Ukraine, south of, Ukra south of Ukraine, called the Donetsk region, which is a very big coal mine region in a very small place, a small village called Kajevka. We arrived with uh, SS Germans and 32 Jews. The Russians were smart enough, they didn't involve to run the camp. They gave to the Germans. So there was a German commandant for the camp, and Germans, uh, not capo, not guard, but German officers, who was, they were running the camp. The, they, they were chief of the kitchen, chief of the, uh, of the group, of the building. So we have to take order in German from the Germans, from the SS Germans. The chief of the camp is a high-ranking officer of the Russian army. And because he was a Jew, and he wanted to hear everybody's story, everybody's lifetime story, what happened. So he was crying when he heard the stories. Each of us told a short, he was crying, and he said, I will take good care of you. And he did. He doesn't want to have any accusation from from, from the non-Jews officers, he's doing something special for the Jews. He ordered us to work in the stone mine, hammer and chisel stone mine. For three months we worked there, and we were sure, one by one, we were not going to make it. In 1945, December, I developed a scurvy. Uh, very bad scurvy. I had 105 or so uh, fever, and my body was beaten up. I was gum. I was losing my, my 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 teeth one by one. Uh, my tongue was swollen. I couldn't eat. Couldn't eat. Days and days I went without. I lost weight. I was like a toothpick. White hair. I walk with canes, not real canes, but piece of wood. And you were 20 years old at this time. I was 20 and three, three quarter. And you were an old man. Yes, and an old man is dying. 